everybody, welcome to my talk. I am Matteo Frana, founder of React Bricks, and I'm gonna tell you the story of content management since the very beginning. So get ready and I will show you why we need a revolutionary product today that will change the way people edit websites. Back to 1996, when I started creating websites, you used a tool like this to write HTML that you would send to a server via FTP. And was it a pain? No, it was great. I was 17 and they had customers who paid me to write this strange code. But the fact is, those pages never changed. So let's start our journey from HTML. When the need to, for editing pages became a thing, front page appeared. On the CD you read professional websites without programming. Microsoft added GPT already, no? <laughs> but you could edit in a visual way with the added bonus of beautiful unusable themes. <laughs> so we had visual editing, but the code created was a mess. For anything you touched, you had four levels of nested tables inside of tables. And then customers wanted to edit the content by themselves. But uh, if you gave them front page, they would destroy the website before you could say front page. And so came CGI. You wrote programs in Perl executed on the server that would write the HTML code for you. So you could create a beautiful interface to let customers edit content on a database and then read from this database and create HTML, which is powerful. And ASP and PHP just made it easier with the templating language. But you see, the visual editing of front page was lost. And there was another problem. We were reinventing the wheel every time. So CMSs were created, Joomla, then WordPress, and we had the visual editing again. Essentially HTML saved on database and users could write the big green comic sans title over red background. So we added custom fields to WordPress to get back our beloved gray forms. All structure, all good. And we lost visual editing once again. But the need for visual editing is there, so Wix and Webflow satisfy it with a great UX. The problem is that they are not suitable for corporate websites because we don't need a template we love, but the pixel perfect corporate image. And we need also good constraints for content editors to be sure that the design can't be broken as soon as uh, editors understand how to touch margins and paddings in Webflow, they can use their creativity to break the design. <laughs> so we have great visual editing, but we need to move away from it. And so we come to headless CMSs, a dream for developers because we are free to do whatever we want on the front end and we have structured data on the back end. But guess what? We are back to gray forms and bye bye to visual editing. Oh, yeah, we have the instant preview, which is like writing a Word or Pages document in a sidebar form and see the preview on the page. You think it's a great UX? Well, if this is a dream for developers, it is surely a nightmare for editors. This is why we need something new, which is finally good for both content editors and developers. Welcome to React Bricks. You create content blocks as a React component and you make them visually editable by using the React Bricks components like image text, rich text, repeater, and you get in line through visual editing. And for the other props you need, for example, to change padding or choose the background color, you can map props to sidebar controls only the props that you want with the values that you want and that are part of the design system. For each text, only the rich text features you want to enable with your render functions for each style. And you have structured JSON saved on that base. Content editors use your Lego bricks of content, which is fun, and they can't break the design. And they are not lost among abstract entities and relationships. They see pages, they create pages, this simple and clear concept. So editors don't need our support because it's easy. As Word or Pages, they already know how to use it. 
and we didn't forget to include batteries with the collaboration, multi-language, fine-grained permissions, ability to reuse content in cross pages, use data from external data sources like Shopify and much more. But don't take my word for it. Here you have Giulio Michelon, founder of the digital agency Belka. Hi, I am Giulio, the founder of Belka. In Belka, we develop digital products for other companies and recently we had uh, the pleasure of working with one of the major Italian banks. We evaluated different tools, uh, such as Headless or such as Webflow, but in the end, we decided to stick with React Bricks for a couple of reasons. First one is the GDPR compliance, fully European platform. And the second one has been the ease of use of the tool. Uh, we didn't expect to be so easy to adopt. Uh, we have good experience with React, which helped. But uh, in the end, also the customer support team was great in helping us uh, embracing this new solution. The marketing team of our customers has been also very happy because of the ease of use of the tool. It's really easy to compose pages. Uh, so in the end, I can really recommend uh, React Bricks as a tool for developing new websites. Okay, time is up. You are just one minute away from trying React Bricks. You just need a free account and to launch a CLI command, npx create React Bricks app at the latest. And uh, on the website, you find a step-by-step -step tutorial with gamification to become a guru of React Bricks in a couple of hours. Last thing, we just opened our partner program for agencies, so contact me, please. Thank you. Let's make content editing fun again.